Once, when I spotted an ex-boyfriend in a department store, I pretended to be a shop mannequin to avoid having to speak to him. Lee. Well, I know what I want to see. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Definitely. sorry, no, it's probably different. <laughs> <laughs> See the mannequin thing. All oh, right. Oh yeah. Whatever. Yeah, do that. Yeah. Do that, but then we do mine. Yeah. <laughs> I would like to see the mannequin impression. Well, I, I, um, it was in the department where they used to um, sell a lot of fabrics, and they used to have mannequins draped in in just swathes of cloth. So I grabbed a, a swathe of cloth. fabric mm. and just grabbed it across my mm. shoulder, and it. It was full length. Where was this? Well, we haven't said where it was. It was in Dickens and Jones on Regent Street. Oh, mm. lovely. And when, when was this? Oh, uh, it's a long time ago, early in the 60s. Surely you weren't old enough to shop on your own in the early 60s, Joe? <laughs> <laughs> so gallant. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I believe you. <laughs> I've said sorry to mannequins before now in the in the department stores. I've done yeah, that. but what were you doing to them? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, Lee? Is it the uh, truth? Warren, what do you think? Do you think there's? Um... I you, I think she's telling the truth. Really? Do you think? Yeah, I, 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 the I, thing for me is, if you're within six or eight foot of an ex and you don't recognise it because you're static, uh, it just seems. I wouldn't know. I've never been allowed within eight feet of my ex. <laughs> Go on, then. I'll say it's a, a lie. OK, they're saying it's a lie. Uh, Joan, was it the truth or was it a lie? It's a lie. Ah, <laughs> a lie! <laughs>